The president of the Islamic Republic of Iran, Raisi Ibrahim, has called out the Western countries on the attack on the family as an institution by promoting homosexuality. This was during his official visit at State House in Tebe. The two nations signed four memorandums of understanding focusing on agriculture, visa exemptions, industries and a joint communique. Sayed Ebrahim Raisi is the fourth president from the Islamic Republic of Iran to visit Uganda. During bilateral discussions with President Hiram Seveni, Rais commended Uganda for its stance in fighting for the family as a core of society by standing against homosexuality. He also blamed the West world for destroying the same by promoting homosexuality. I believe that uh, these issues and these strong attacks by the West against the establishment of the families and against the culture of the na nations is another area of cooperation for Iran and Uganda. The Western countries try to identify homosexuality as an index of civilization while this is one of the dirtiest. The Iranian head of state who is on an African tour also blamed Western countries for promoting violence across the globe and creating a negative narrative about other states like his own. Trying to promote separatism, extremism, breeding terrorists, digging people against each other, that creating terror and violence. So they are trying to promote these issues. And I believe that Iran and Uganda can ensure mutual cooperation in these areas as well. The two presidents agreed on working together to promote trade between the Uganda and Iranian nations. And we believe that we need to further expand and promote the level of our bilateral relations with Uganda, especially in political, economic, cultural, scientific and technological fields. The area of cooperation is trade. Because as you can see here, the climate is very good. There is no, nothing on earth we cannot produce. And uh, we, we have a, a lot of food. We always have the problem of markets. President Yerim Seveni also welcomed Iranian investors to invest in Uganda's oil and gas sector. In your country, a necessity of creating and establishing refineries in this regard. When it comes to energy in general, and, we, or, and when it comes to oil industry specifically, uh, the Islamic Republic of Iran enjoys good experience in this regard, and we stand ready to share our experience with Uganda regarding the issue of refineries and regarding the issue of the technical and engineering services. The two nations signed four memorandums of understanding, focusing on agriculture, industries, visa exemption, and a joint communique. Kanarum Gume, Jamila Mulindo and Nwaha, NBS, live at nine.